Uh, Vic Pena, drop to spotlight. Hey, how you doing? Hey, nice to meet you. Hey, nice to meet you all. How y'all doing today? Very good, thanks. Great, thank you. Awesome, great to hear, great to hear. Uh, first things first, uh, can you tell us a little bit about your new show, Sugar? Our initial sugar, how we got involved with it? Uh, yes. Yeah. Um, uh, well, uh, Mark Portisevich, uh, the creator of the show um, uh, and the writer, wrote um, a fantastic spec script that was um, the first episode and actually first couple episodes uh, of the series. Uh, he and Audrey uh, go back a long way. He gave the script to Audrey. She read it, flipped for it, gave it to me. I flipped for it. And that is how we got started. It really just started with a script that um, Mark had been working on for many years. It's great to hear. That's great to hear. <laughs> <laughs> Another question I had was, uh, was there any challenges while filming the show? Um, sure. Like with any show, there are challenges. I think the challenge, but also one of the one of the things we were most excited by in filming the show was kind of the balancing act of creating a show that felt like a throwback to a neo-noir, but also infused this incredibly modern style that Fernando Morella has brought to the table as well. And so trying to do that across the board with the look and aesthetic and with our costumes and production design, obviously everyone had to be in sync at all times and all the details really mattered. So I think that was one of the biggest challenges, but also I think a massive payoff for us hmm. as well. It's great to hear, cause it's, it's so good. Like it's the, <laughs> it's the mix of your, the story as well as the classical movies. Mm. Mm. Yeah. I, cool. I really enjoyed that. Did you guys uh, have any uh, touch base of uh, looking into the, the classical movies bits, like putting that information into the movie? Yeah, that was, you know, we'd always talked about uh, movies that were sort of inspiration um, and uh, touchdowns for for the show. Um, and, uh, but, so we talked about Chinatown, uh, we talked Long Goodbye, we talked about the original, Big Sleep, the Sam Spade, Marlowe, great film noirs. Um, uh, but they were really inspiration. And then Fernando Morales um, uh, and his editor, who's also named Fernando, mm -hmm. um, uh, when in post production, they just went away and started to insert those film clips into um, the episodes, and and it wasn't something that was in the script. It wasn't something that we even really talked about. They just did it, and we watched it, and it brought the show to life um, uh, in a in a kind of whole new and wildly both nostalgic and fresh uh, modern way. You know, because it is pretty radical to have in a show. Yes, it's fantastic. It's hypnotizing. <laughs> like, oh, look at that. Look at that. <laughs> Great. And lastly, what do you want uh, viewers to experience when they first watch Sugar? I think in addition to everything we're talking about, this unique tone and style, the character of John Sugar. He is, mm. he feels like an iconic, classic leading man. And at the same time, he has, you know, he's really... Um, thoughtful and kind and chivalrous and those are qualities you don't often see in today's leading men mm -hmm. and so it's someone um, we're really excited for audiences to experience. Awesome that is great to hear and it's very exciting we can't wait for our viewers to watch the first episode of the show coming soon on Thank TV Plus. Thank, Thank you so, so much. much.